Hi, my name is Barry Crampton. Today I'm going to show you around our Hyundai i40, but first I'll tell you a little bit more about it. It's a 1.7 CRDI premium 5-door, 2012 on a 12 plate, has done 24,118 miles with a full service history, fuel economy, urban 47.9 miles per gallon, extra urban a fantastic 61.4 miles per gallon and combined is 55.4 miles per gallon. 0 to 60 time of 10.6 seconds, a top speed of 124 miles per hour out of a 134 brake horsepower 16 valve engine. Road tax is pretty cheap as well, 6 months £79.75 and 12 months is £145. The car is uh, MOT'd until the 1st of the 7th 2020. From parking sensors, I'll try step through the quagmire here, uh, multi-spoke alloys, we've got the chrome bright work around the windows, rear privacy glass, roof bars and the full panoramic uh, sunroof. Got the integrated uh, tailgate spoiler, rear privacy glass again, your rear wiper, reversing sensors in the back there, electric boot release, uh, plenty of room in the back there for uh, all your luggage. Um, Roller blind, load cover, really nice in the back, nice and clean in the back. And uh, if you've got a dog or anything, it's a nice low step for it to get into. It's ideal, really. Plenty of room in the back here. Uh, my seat is where I'd normally drive, so I've, I've not moved it forward or anything. Bags of leg room, seats are like brand new. The pan roof in the back here, so it's nice, light and airy. And uh, you've got little uh, entry and exit lights there. The suit hooks and so on. Just straighten that. Brushed aluminium here, brushed al aluminium door handles. Rear armrest with two big cup holders here. So uh, really, really nice car. Over mats. It's, it's like new in the back here. It's, it really is lovely. I'll just take you for a ride in it. The car's got keyless entry and keyless go, so as long as you've got your, the key on you, you can uh, press a button on the door and it opens. And uh, same here, just foot on the clutch and uh, And now, continuity is a bit of a problem today. <laughs> when I was doing the outside a few minutes ago, it was lovely sunshine, and now it's virtually snowing, so uh, hence the, uh, the sunglasses. So, here we go. First of all, these, those are all the bills there for the servicing. It's hard service. 11th the 6th 2013 at 5,283 miles, uh, riders of Warrington. 24th the 6th 2014 at 8,199 miles, Sandbrook Service Centre. 23rd of the 6th 2015, 11,303 miles, Sandbrook Service Centre. 28th the 6th 2016, 14,729 miles, Sandbrook Service Centre. 27th of the 6th, 2017, 16,293 miles, um, Wide Cross Service Station. 26th of the 6th, 2018, 20,785 miles, Wide Cross Service Station again. And lastly, 2nd of the 7th, 2019, 23,332 miles, Wide Cross Service Station. And the car's done 24,142 miles. As I say, there's... Um, a bill there for two tyres as well. I um, can't just see the date on that, but uh, not too long ago. So, really, really nice car, and it's, uh, it always makes me wonder. You've, you've got all all these books and wallets and so on, but no service book, uh, digital service history or something. 
incredibly stupid idea. Right, I'll just take you for a uh, <laughs> for a ride in it. So we've got heated seats, height and reach adjustable steering wheel. Hopefully the wipers are good today, and uh, we've got electronic handbrake. Let's just put that on. So it's on there. Just see if it goes off when we set off. Yeah, that's it. So it goes off automatically. I notice here you've got parking sensors as well, and you've got auto hold. Uh, I'm assuming that's uh, well, it will be hill hold. The self dipping mirror, lovely pan roof here. So that's tilt and slide as well. Get that shut quick. The shade band there. It's got wet. <laughs> A couple of clicks. Bugger. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. Go. That's better. Now that takes a bit of working out. It's it's certainly not foolproof. We've got electric seats as well. Let's just get a bit further back there. Gosh, where to start? Turn that down. Got sat nav. You can have it on the map there. Just got to agree you're not going to get distracted. Um, just went to get some diesel at the station before I uh, set up on this drive and the car pulled up next to me and it was a taxi and uh, it was one of these so uh, there is bags of room in them I have to say bags of load space as well plenty of room for five adults in the luggage in comfort we've got Bluetooth hands-free Bluetooth audio streaming as well six-speed gearbox power folding door mirrors rear wash wipe front and rear parking sensors armrest here with storage space in there and uh, usually you find the auxiliary and USB in socket there but there's a little nice piano black flap there you've got another power socket in there and USB and auxiliary nicely finished I did notice um, before, I'm not sure whether I'll be able to do it here, but um, 30 miles an hour in six, the car will just pull without your foot on the accelerator or the, um, or the clutch, or it'll just, just pull along. How are we getting... Uh, I think it might have lane departure warning on it. A, there was something bonging. We've got auto hold there, so the handbrakes come on automatically. Um, just holding you on a slight incline. Your hot and cold switches there. Climate control in the centre here. Radio, telephone. So the, the maps button quite handy. Let's see. Your mirrors here. There you go. And the auto holes come off. Straight away. I'm going to 
tuck in behind this van because I think he's in a bit of a, oh dear me, overtaking on this bend in the wet in a van. It's so slippy, this bend. So that van guy overtook on a bend and then cut in where there's no room to go down here. I think I'll just put lights on, it's automatic lights there. Nice drive. Seats are really nice and comfortable. As I say, le electric seat adjustment for the backrest there, and uh, up and down leg adjustment too. Great gearbox. Multifunction steering wheel. Nice design as well, this kind of brushed aluminium effect there. Matches the, well, it's, it's probably darker than anodized, perhaps, aluminium. And um, you've got your audio controls there. We've got cruise here on the right hand side. Let's just see. All right. So you're going to switch it on there. So uh, another. Another thing that's not foolproof on here, you've got to switch it on first of all. We'll just get up to 70 there. So you've got to switch it on and then set it so it's a, a two two touch got a safety catch so you don't do it accidentally I suppose that's uh, 70 miles an hour six gear just over 2,000 revs everybody bunching up here at 60 miles an hour lorry trying to overtake instrument cluster. Rev counter on the left in the centre of the rev counter is your coolant temperature gauge. Your information display in the, the centre showing me distance to empty and uh, you can just move that by, there you go, instantaneous fuel economy, average speed, elapsed time, economy driving off or eco driving off, user settings. guy behind me I think he's in a hurry we'll just see what desperate maneuver he does here the funny feeling he was going to just undertake me then so hence hanging back this roundabout seems to bring out the worst in people Nice family vehicle. Let's 
vehicles, ideal business vehicle as well, very economical, nice and comfortable. Finished in silver with black leather seats. Black leather heated seats. Nice all round cup holders here. Pretty good acceleration. Fifty miles an hour there. So you get Bluetooth hands-free here. If you click on media, that's that's Bluetooth there, um, and we'll play anything that's on my phone or that's playing on my phone just turn that up Manfred Mann's Earth Band it's MOT'd until July 1st of July 2020 I service every couple of thousand miles really Really, really well looked after, lovely car. I can imagine that this vehicle has belonged to somebody who is the equivalent of our customer, Mr. Riding, who absolutely looks after everything, his whole family, makes sure everything's serviced and MOT'd and running spick and span. We need more customers like him. There we go. Looks like we're in a bit of a queue here. I'll stop in a second, um, show you how to set the sat nav, pay your mobile, delete a mobile, and stream audio but um, lovely car I can't find anything wrong with it whatsoever actually I just need to try the back wiper yep that's good too squirties yep everything everything's working perfectly all nice no marks anywhere Another great car. Um, I don't think there's going to be too many other vehicles with a service history like this and this sort of mileage. So we're probably going to be up there on Auto Trader, probably one of the last ones you come to, sadly, because of the mileage and we'll see how we get on with it. In the meantime, uh, thanks for watching again. Don't forget to check out our website, ggcars.co.uk. I've just got a message of somebody who's been watching my Range Rover videos and they've they've just bought a Range Rover somewhere else sadly so don't forget you can always come and <laughs> you can always come and buy a car off us that would be much appreciated too thanks for watching see you in the next video I'm just trying to think what it Skoda we just got a, a lovely Skoda Fabia in so it may well be that but we've got a couple of vans as well <laughs>